cream? No, thank you. I take it black, like my man. <laughs> Oh my. Ooh. Welcome back to Tara's Never Seen. Hi everybody. Look, look at this. My daughter made this with her own two little hands. She crocheted it. And probably her feet too. Chris. She did not use her feet. <laughs> oh, it's so soft and it's so warm. Yay. She's coming along with her little Etsy shop. We'll put a link. Go order some things. Crocheting is one way that she, it helps her in her seizures. Like it, it helps take her mind off of the, the, she calls it the brain buzz. She just started this hobby right before Christmas and she is making things left and right. Purses, gloves, sweaters, blankets, all kinds of things. She's doing a great job and she made this for me. Okay. So anyway, today we're going to watch something I may or may not have seen. Honestly, don't remember. The only thing I know, we watch, we're going to watch Airplane. I do know that I've seen, like, growing up, TBS, uh, they would play, like, clips of movies, different movies. And I do know, like, the one clip was a Don't Call Me Shirley. I do know I've seen that clip on TBS because we used to watch TBS all the time for our... Our Braves. Go Braves. Go Braves. And yes, you could probably see it better in this video than the Lord of the Rings video. My hair is now purple. Change is good. So don't forget to click smash all the things, okay? The like button, subscribe button, notification bell. What else? We're on Patreon for a whole doll hair. Airplane, apparently. Ear hole muffs going in. Airplane. Three, two, one, play. <laughs> It's Jaws music. It's loud. That is one thing I hate doing is driving around the Atlanta airport. Oh yeah, it's a nightmare. It is a complete nightmare. Would you care to make a donation? No, but thank you anyway. <laughs> no, the white zone is for loading and unloading. The red zone has always been for loading and unloading. Don't tell me which zone is for <laughs> <laughs> me. <laughs> Would you like to make a donation? No thanks. We gave it the office. I know that guy. You put all your metal objects into this dish, please. How did I know? Really, Vernon? Why pretend? <laughs> As you're talking about. <laughs> Have an abortion. It's really the only sensible thing to do. Taxi! I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Sir, we'd like you to have this flower on behalf of the Church of Religious. <laughs> That's one way to get rid of them. <laughs> hey, Larry, where's the forklift? It's over there with a the baggage loader. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't live with the man I don't respect. Yeah. What'd you do? What a pisser. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> Modern, Modern sperm. sperm. Wow. <laughs> Dominant females. Box lunch. Box lunch. That's a good Whoa. one. Whoa. <laughs> no, the white phone. <laughs> this is Captain Over. Moment for your call from the Mayo Clinic. Over, white courtesy phone. Captain Clarence Over. I've got it. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, this is Dr. Brody at the Mayo Clinic. There's a passenger on your Chicago... The, the Mayo, Mayo Clinic. Clinic. <laughs> we have the heart here, ready for surgery. I want you to make sure that she's kept oh God. in a reclined position. What the hell? I have an emergency call for you on line five from a Mr. Ham. All right, give me Ham on five. Hold the mail. <laughs> <laughs> so this is, so far I can tell, this is one of those movies where the music and the sound are going to be way louder than the talking. Dinner. We'll, we'll talk things over. I won't be back. I've requested the Atlanta run. Oh, God, you're coming to Hartsville, Jackson. Don't do it. You know, I haven't been able to get near a plane since the war. When I get back to Chicago, I'm going to start my life all over again. I'm sorry. She's done. 
all the way done. Excuse me, we'd like you to have this flower from the Church of Religious Conscience. <laughs> <laughs> Any word on that uh, storm lifting over Salt Lake, Clarence? No, not likely, Victor. Is that JJ? Yep. 1600 hours through 2400. Is he gonna make a dynamite? Look at him checking under the. High <laughs> and far ceilings all the way. <laughs> Wasn't racing around 15. <laughs> Sorry, Clarence. Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Kareem Abdul Jabbar. My mom can't say his name. <laughs> Little boy was not checking out that little girl. Oh yeah, she is on board. I'd like one ticket to Chicago. <laughs> that guy's just still sitting there waiting. And that meter is running. Smoking or non-smoking? Smoking, please. That used to be a thing you could smoke on planes. Absolutely. Wow. I have a collection somewhere upstairs of plane ashtrays. Shit, man, that honky muff me mess my old lady. Got to be right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, I can dig it. No, he ain't gonna lay no more big rap up on you, man. Mac a self approach. Lick the gray matter back. Lot performers down. I <laughs> <laughs> lay her down or smack him, yak him. Shit. This ticket's still smoking. El Noah, you a smoker. <laughs> nervous? Yes. First time. No, I've been nervous lots of times. <laughs> Every day, Bill. Better get on board, son. All aboard! I love you, darling! But it's your watch! You shouldn't! You're gonna need this! I hope she runs into something. Goodbye, darling! Close the door! Oh. Bill! Oh. oh, yeah. Roger. Huh? Roger. Huh? Request vector. Over. What? We have clearance, Clarence. Roger, Roger. What's our vector, Victor? Okay. Roger. Huh? Roger, over. What? Who's on first? What's on second? I don't know who's on third. <laughs> the music. The music's so intense. <laughs> I haven't flown for a long time. Same. I'm not very good at it. Our arrival time in Chicago. The temperature there is currently... <laughs> no wonder you're upset. She's lovely. And a darling figure. Supple, pouting breasts. Firm thighs. Wow. Things used to be different. I remember when we first met. It was during the war. She's already over it. <laughs> she was the trombone player? Really? <laughs> Are they supposed to be Girl Scouts? <laughs> she thinks he's coming up with some good dance moves. So his hat was like a boomerang? Convenient. Yeah. have I seen this guy like he looks very His familiar name is Robert Hayes he's probably on friends meow Those Girl Scouts are still fighting? But enough about me. I hope this hasn't been boring for you. It's just that whenever I start to... Oh, no. <laughs> ...get so carried away, I lose all track of times. Gee, that'd be swell. Would it now? I happen to be passing. I thought you'd might like some coffee. Oh, that's very nice of you. Thank you. Well, won't you sit down? Thank you. Cream? No, thank you. I take it black, like my man. <laughs> Oh my. Ooh. 
My squadron ships out tomorrow, bombing the storage depots at Daiquiri at 1,800 hours. We're coming in from the north, below their radar. When will you be back? I can't tell you that. It's classified. <laughs> but you told her all the other stuff. It's coming in north under the radar. It's completely okay. Is that a sea slug and a fish behind them? We have a visitor. Hello. Hi. She's like, I don't know about kisses. She does, too. Joey is in the cockpit. You ever been in a cockpit before? No, sir. I've never been up in a plane before. You ever seen a grown man naked? Why would he Why would he ask that? That's so wrong. You ever hang around the gymnasium? <laughs> what? Wait a minute. I know you. You're Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. You play basketball for the Los Angeles Lakers. I'm sorry, son, but you must have me confused with someone else. You are Kareem. I think you should go back to your seat now, Joey. My name is Roger Murdoch. I think you're the greatest, but my dad says you don't work hard enough on defense. <laughs> okay, Al, see you later. And that you don't really try, except during the playoffs. The hell I don't. <laughs> Tell your old man to drag Walton in the near up and down the court for 48 minutes. Joey, you like movies about gladiators? The most random questions to the kid. As my mom calls him, Cream Abdujabar. It's so cute to watch her try. I remember how you used to hold me. How I used to sit on your face and wriggle. And afterwards, how we'd watch until the sun came up. She would sit on his face and what? Wiggle. <laughs> That's what I thought. Wow. Is he painting happy little trees? Really? Because of my mistake, six men didn't return from that raid. Seven, Lieutenant Zip died this morning. Hey, Stryker, how about a break? Yeah, all right. Take five. Oh, my God. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Could I borrow your guitar? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and I saw that I was looking at... <laughs> There is only one river, there is only one sea. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, after the war, just wanted to get as far away from things as possible. So he's just telling the story to anybody. Excuse me, your balls are showing. All righty then. At first, they didn't know what to think of us, but soon we gained their trust. <laughs> also, Tupperware, Tupperware party deal for storing leftovers to help Ooh. stretch your food dollar. Rudimentary game skills and finally advanced oh competitive theory. I was patient with them and they were eager to learn. They seemed to enjoy themselves. It's time for us to go back home to the plans we made before the war. A lot of people made plans before the war, like George Zip. I realized Elaine had doubts about our relationship. And that, as much as anything else, led to my drinking problem. <laughs> well, I could go on for hours, but I'd probably start to bore you. Elaine, <laughs> she wanted a career. <laughs> Me too. As the second person that's killed themselves sitting next to him. Oh, it's my stomach. She's gonna shit herself. Captain, one of the woman passengers is very sick. Uh oh, he's back. You're on board as quietly as you can. Joey, have you ever been in a in a Turkish prison? I should have had that second cup of coffee. Uh oh, is everybody gonna get sick? Oh. 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 Jim never vomits at home. <laughs> what is she? Doctor, there's nothing to worry about. Oh my about. god. I have to wake you. You were a doctor? That's right. Oh my god, Leslie Nielsen. Yes, of course. I mean, she's already clearly got the eggs coming out of her mouth. Why is he acting like he's. I don't. I'll be back whatever. in a minute. Pause, just for your clarification, he was doing sleight of hand magic. He was holding the eggs in his hand, and she had whatever was in her mouth. She just kept like acting like it was another egg coming out, but he was pulling the eggs out of his hand, like sleight of hand magic. Okay. That was kind of the I, I could see it, but I was like, why does she... Yeah. She it wasn't very good. 
she keeps it, you know, regurgitating eggs, and he's supposed to be pulling them out of her mouth. But the only way to really do that is for her to fake spitting it into his hand and him okay. to pull the egg. It was out of super his hand. annoying for me. It, it was sleight of hand magic up close. It was he was actually really good at it. I mean, it's you it could tell lame. he was doing something, you know. But I love you. I love it. <laughs> okay, three, two, one, play. You better tell the captain we've got to land as soon as we can. This woman has to be gotten to a hospital. A hospital? What is it? It's a big building with patients, but that's not important. Right? <laughs> it's a big building with patients. <laughs> they keep doing that same joke over and over. Everybody that's getting sick, they drink the coffee. How soon can you land? I can't tell. You can tell me I'm a doctor. No, I mean, I'm just not sure. <laughs> but can't you take a guess? Not for another two hours. You can't take a guess for another two hours? <laughs> no, 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 I mean, we can't land for another two hours. Well, we had a choice, steak or fish. Yes, yes, I remember I had lasagna. <laughs> yes, of course, we both had fish. Why? Oh, it, it's nothing to be alarmed about. And he had the two cups of coffee. <laughs> Every passenger on this plane will have fish for dinner. We'll become violently ill in the next half hour. Uh-oh. If the virus penetrates red blood cells, the victim becomes dizzy. From there, the poison goes to work on the <laughs> central nervous system. Followed by the inevitable drooling. Uh. Accompanied by uncontrollable flagellants. But uh. finally, the poor bastard is reduced to a quivering, wasted piece of jelly. Uh. <laughs> 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 no sex. Only in rows 13 through 51, though. Yeah. Oh my god. Hold all takeoffs. I don't want another. Oh god, I know that guy too. It's like I picked the wrong week to quit smoking. Get me Rex Kramer. That is Lloyd Bridges, by the way. That's it. Jeff Bridges' daddy. Yeah. And Bo Bridges' daddy. On the belt line of the automatic pipe, there's a hollow tube. He's pointing the cigarette. What the hell's going on up there? What is he doing? <laughs> Giving a pelvic exam? <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. She needed, they needed a cigarette, both of them, the inflatable and her, needed a cigarette after that. Elaine, you're a member of this crew. Can you face some unpleasant facts? No. All right. Same. Is there anyone on board who can land this plane? It's a drinking problem, yeah. No, no one I know of. The life of everyone on board depends upon just one thing. Finding someone back there who can not only fly this plane, but who didn't have fish for dinner. Wouldn't that be two things? <laughs> I mean, I can't math very good, but... By the way, is there anyone on board who knows how to fly a plane? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> The Harry Christians are going crazy. Mm hmm. What's a movie without boobs right in your face? I want that Mustang. <gasps> I want to pet that dog. Yeah, I want that dog. I bet that's a good puppy. Yeah, something like that. It's a golden. Chef, no. Again, get used to it. Come. I don't believe that is a mean dog at all. I know better. Look at it. No, Would I'm you in. just look? He might attack you with hugs and kisses. He just wants to play. When they built those roads, they had no thought of drainage in mind. The Jeep up to the main oh road. Oh my God. There's been a little problem in the cockpit. The cockpit? Was... What is it? A little room in the front of the plane where the pilots sit. <laughs> the captain needs someone to help him with the radio. Do you know anything about planes? Would you go up, please? Blow out the match. Thank you. Both pilots. Can you fly this plane and land it? Surely you can't be serious. Don't call me Shirley. I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Besides, I haven't touched any kind of plane in six years. He talks about the war like it was 50 years ago. <laughs> on and on and on and on <laughs> and on and on. I get it. <laughs> Guy's still sitting in the taxi, though. <laughs> I'll be right back. 113 bucks. I mean, after five minutes, I would have gotten out. 
I'd have driven it myself and just take right. it and go home. Where the hell is Kramer? <laughs> <laughs> one of the passengers is going to land that plane. Is that possible? Possible. It's 100 to one shot. <laughs> I know this guy. You do? Who is it? <laughs> do you recognize that guy? Yeah, Unsolved Mysteries. Yeah. Ted, what are you doing here? You, you can't fly this plane. That's what I've been trying to tell these people. I don't have time to say this gently, so I'll be very direct. Everyone on this plane is in a desperate situation. Mr. Stryker is the only hope we've got. Dun, dun, dun. Go back and sit down. <laughs> Eat. I'll take care of this. Calm down. Calm down. Get a hold of yourself. Get another slap in. Oh my god, everybody's in line. What? <laughs> a gun, a baseball bat, a crowbar? Excuse me, we'd like you to have this flower. Excuse me, sir, would you. <laughs> He's so tough. <laughs> Jerry's kids. Scientology? Did he say Scientology? One of them did, yeah. That's a big bag of no. All right, Steve, let's face a few facts. <laughs> the fuck is going on in that what? room? Why? It's like I took the wrong week to quit drinking. Stryker, this is Captain Rex Kramer speaking. Yes, Captain Kramer. Uh-oh. It's obvious you remember me. So what do you say you and I just forget about everything except what we have to do now? My one hope is to build this man up. I've got to give him all the confidence I can. You ever flown a motor engine plane before? No, never. Shit. Later, we'll run down the landing procedure. She's still trying to put on makeup? And why has she been on green paint on her eyes? Oh my god. The inflatable is trying to hump her. Elaine's been through it tonight. What's going on? We have a right to know the truth. All right, I'm going to level with you all. There's no reason to panic. Now, it is true that one of the crew members is ill. Slightly. His nose looks like a pecker. Pilots are just fine, free to pursue a life of uh -huh. religious fulfillment. Liar. <laughs> and keep an eye on that number three engine gauge over there. It's running a little hot. Why you shouldn't have complete confidence in your chances to come out of this. Why is there a vulture? Because vultures circle when things are dying. Ah. Uh. <laughs> All right, Stryker. You're doing just fine. It's a damn good thing he doesn't know how much I hate his guts. It's a damn good thing you don't know how much he hates your guts. You weren't supposed to tell him that, stupid. Mm -hmm. Uh-uh. She but a lamb into the bone. Jack me up. Tight me. I'm sorry, I don't understand. Cuddy say he can't hang. Oh, Stewardess, I speak jive. Oh, good. He said that he Isn't that the mom from the Brady Bunch? No. Leave it to Beaver. Leave it to Beaver, that's it. Just hang loose, blood. You're gonna catch up on the rebound out of med side. What it is, big mama? My mama raised no dummies. I duck a rap. Cut me some slack, Jack. Oh, say, cut him, Chumpton. Chumpton, wanna help? Chumpton, don't get the help. Jive ass dude don't got no brain. Ha 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 why has she got a horse? Yes, I'll be right down. I've got to go to the airport. You can let yourself out the back door. She been... Was she... I don't want to know what she was doing with a horse. Because that is wrong. <laughs> that is animal abuse. They could be miles off course. That's impossible. They're on instruments. Oh, my God. <laughs> Looks like I picked the wrong week to quit amphetamines. <laughs> <laughs> Same. <laughs> I felt that. But he's an experienced Air Force pilot, a flew during the war. Guy's holding ice cream. What kind of plane is it? Oh, it's a big, pretty white plane with red stripes and curtains in the window and wheels, and it looks like a big tile and all. Let's get some pictures. Put them on the fuck wall. Oh my god. Stricken airliner approaching Chicago. News no jikandes. Udahatsu gats. Yep. <laughs> the camera change. <laughs> I say, let him crash. Would you like a little whiskey, man? Certainly not. 
I mean, whatever works for you, works for you, and that's amazing. Like, whatever works for you, like, works for you, and that's amazing. Thank you. Thank you. We're running out of time. Surely there must be something you can do. I'm doing everything I can. Now stop calling me Shirley. I've never been so scared. And besides, I'm 26 and I'm not married. Now we're going to make it. How are you bearing up? To be honest, I've never been so scared. But at least I have a husband. Damn. When Kramer hears about this, the shit's gonna hit the fan. Ew. I was crazy to think I could land this plane. Oh. As soon as he puts the inflatable, it stops shaking. Bad news. The fog is getting thicker. And Leon's getting larger. And win just one for the zipper. I don't know where I'll be then, Doc, he said. That won't smell too good, that's for sure. Excuse me, Doc. I've got a plane to land. Y'all can't see, but Tara's directing the band. The fog lifts will bring in. She's conducting below the camera. <laughs> Played many marches like that in my day. I'm giving the orders and we're coming in. I guess the foot's on the other hand now, isn't it, Kramer? Passengers certain to die. Airline negligent. There's a sale at Penny's. Yes, girl. <laughs> Stand by, Striker. We're going to the tower. Good luck. The tower? Rapunzel! Rapunzel! <laughs> As a kid, that guy was my favorite. I thought he was the funniest one in the movie. Be long now. Try not to worry. I was right. I'm kind of disappointed I'm not laughing more. I, you know, uh, uh, what can I do? I, I, I can only show you a classic comedy. I mean, I get the jokes. I just... You're just not into it. They're just not that funny to me. Get that finger out of your ear. You don't know where that finger's been. Ew. Gross. Ew! Dang. Gross! Your husband and the others are alive, but unconscious. Just like Gerald Ford. No. I think you're right. I think he may be my favorite, too. <laughs> Where did you get that dress? It's awful, and those shoes and that coat, jeez. <laughs> I thought he was gonna give her a compliment on her dress. Penny zero, four, four. Steve, on whatever light you can get poured onto that field. We ain't done right now. <laughs> <laughs> the literal humor is my favorite. Air Israel, please. Oh, God. Oh, isn't that cute? I heard somebody say, oh, isn't that cute? <laughs> WZAZ in Chicago, where disco lives forever. Oh, God. You might get hurt up here. Ah! She walks out there and gets hurt. I just want to tell you both good luck. We're all counting on you. No pressure. That doesn't stop you. She is all... Oh. Big time feeling him up. I want to pet that dog. I pet that dog. Like I picked the wrong week to quit sniffing glue. <laughs> He's picked the wrong week for everything. I know, I know. He knows, he knows. He's <laughs> <laughs> coming right at us. Again. <laughs> Man, he is sweating. Gate eight. Gate nine. Is he gonna park the plane like he did the taxi at the beginning? Like pull it up on the curb? Oh my god. I'm a fan of it's a I just want to tell you both, good luck. We're all counting on you. The man is incredible. He's great. I love him. But damn. We're okay. Ted, that was probably the lousiest landing in the history of this airport. Some of us here, particularly me. I'd like to buy you a drink and shake your hand. I'm 
Ted, I just want you to know that when the going got rough, <laughs> loneliness, that's the bottom line. This Never guy's still talking. Child. Christmas, Ted, what does that mean to you? To me, it was a living hell. <laughs> Now the kid's not going to get her heart. Municipal bonds, Ted. I'm talking double A rating. Best investment in America. Is that guy ever going to shut up? <laughs> Creepy. <laughs> oh, Lord. All right, you've seen Airplane. Yeah. I'm kind of disappointed I didn't laugh. Uh, you know? As much as I expected to. I can't predict them, I guess. I thought you were going to like it a lot more than you do. I, I, you know you like dumb humor. And yeah. It's nothing but dumb humor. It just... it. Did it feel a little dated to you and just kind of slow? Think, and... I think so. I think that's what it was. I think it was just so dated and the jokes to me were so lame that I... It's... Typically, lame jokes I find funny. Right. But they were, to me, I guess they were so lame that even I could, I was just like, really? Well, that's two now. Airplane and Blazing Saddles. <laughs> but I, I didn't like Blazing Saddles. No. But you like this okay. I, yeah. I mean, I don't hate it. Right. It, it, it's got people I like. like Leslie Nielsen. I, I can remember watching movies with him in it when I was little. And just thinking he was the greatest comedian to ever live. Well, the reason he's in those movies is this movie. Right. All like his his this. timing, his He was a serious he, actor up until this movie. He his his comedic timing is like none other. Right. And it's because he's so serious and deadpan and pal- Yeah, and, like, and that's that's what I find hilarious. Well that's they the so but, the guys who made this movie they, that's why they cast him as the doctor and they're like, dude, just keep it Keep it straight and you'll be hilarious. And Oh my god. Right. <laughs> yeah. Like I mean it had to me it had its moments, but for the most part, meh. Okay. Meh. I don't I love it. You you got your own brain over there and I love it. I <laughs> do. You say I'm from somewhere. I don't you know don't where know where you're from. I can't pinpoint it. But <laughs> you're from somewhere. I do. I am I am my own little world. Mm-hmm. My brain is its own being. And I just, I don't know, I, I, but I, I think you're right. I think you nailed it. I think had I saw this maybe 20 years ago, or maybe if I had sat and watched it while it was on TBS. Right, in your teens. In my teens, I probably would have found this a whole lot funnier. It would probably would have been... It felt a little honestly. I, it's the first time I sat and watched the full film in probably twenty five years. Uh, yeah, it felt slow to me. It, the pacing was, but I know that it. That's because it. It is basically like this other movie called Airport. I believe that they, the the guys that made it, kind of watched this old black and white movie one night that was this melodrama thing about a plane, mm-hmm. and they basically took the script for that and then added some jokes and like. The scripting and the pacing of it is and based the, on and that the thing old is, is, is I'm all for a good spoof. Right, I am. Right, I, I, Hot Shots, Hot Shots Part Two, um, do, 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 you know, uh, uh, what is it, Naked Gun, and yeah, things all, like that. All those are derivative I'm, of this, though. This, was yeah, the first I'm, to do it. I am all for. What's the one with? Um, I used to love it, Val Kilmer. Val Kilmer did a, a... Oh, yeah, that's them, too. Uh, it's called... Um, I used to love that one, too. I can't remember no, the name of it. No, you got me out of thinking now. Used... Um, secret? Top Secret? Top Secret. Top Secret. Yeah, that's it. But, yeah, I used to love, you know, movies like that. But, but I, I don't know. I think, you know, even, like, the... Um, the first one. I never saw any of the other ones. Not another teen movie. That one. I love that one. That one gets me every fucking time. Um, it's in the vein of this. Though. Like everything's a joke. Right. And jokes on right. top of jokes. And, right. And making fun of something and else. And callbacks to other yes. stuff. And making fun I, of certain scenes. Yeah. yeah. So. But I don't know. I, I guess. I, I think you're right though. I think had I saw this. At some point on TBS when I was a teenager, 
I probably would have found it a lot funnier back then and then therefore would have probably still remembered how funny I thought it was then, which would have made me think of how funny it, it you know, make me laugh now. But now it's just kind of like, that's it. I don't know. I've, I've, se- I've seen better. I've laughed harder. Don't, I've laughed don't, a lot more. Don't apologize for your opinion. Your I'm opinion. not apologizing for it. Okay. If you don't like it, that's that's a you problem, not a me problem. Um, do, you, do you remember ever seeing the second one? The second one is about going to space. Airplane 2 that is the first commercial space flight. No. And Sonny Bono is in it. No, it him. sounds just as awful as this one. It is goofy <laughs> as hell and very funny no, to me too. And I mean awful in a good way. <laughs> like the, this one, it's not, it's not bad. It's just one of those, oh my God, seriously. Like I just, I don't you know. I rolled into a couple dimensions a couple times. I saw it. Yeah. I love it. I yeah. can't wait to edit your eye rolls off into a, a Take universe. a shot every time you see me eye roll. <laughs> okay. Some of, some of the jokes felt very lame to me. Just, and once again, it's not that I didn't get them. It's just... It's almost as if somebody was standing in front of me right now today telling these jokes. I'd be like, dude, you're trying too hard. That's that's what I mean when I say lame okay. for this movie. It's just like, to me, it was trying too hard. But it wasn't trying at the same time. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm. It makes sense in my brain. And I know my brain's from somewhere. So mm-hmm. Definitely. I don't know. Parts unknown. I- anyway, that's... So I'm not disappointed in myself at all that I haven't seen it. I'm, I'm not mad. I'm not mad at me. Not at all. So, yeah, there we go. Airplane. Fantastic. So, click smash all the things, and we'll see you next time, guys. Later. <laughs>